of Restoring Our Own Through Transformation, also known as ROOT. And I'm Dorian Wingard, the COO at ROOT as well. Um, we were asked um, to talk a little bit about our organization and why it was that we started. I think that it's important to note that both of us are um, parents and myself being soon to be grandparent and Dorian already five. being a grandparent <laughs> and knowing that we both came from uh, public health, clinical and public policy. We've had the opportunity to be able to see what um, has been impacting our communities in a very different way from an experiential place as well as a professional place. Right. And we knew that we had the solutions that would be able to help address these inequities that um, disproportionately impact black families in our community. And that's our focus. I mean, so far since 2017, we've been able to maintain a 0% infant maternal, infant and maternal mortality rate. And it's because of our commitment to addressing health inequity period and end of sentence. We understand that there are different variables that impact black families and black communities, and we focus specifically on addressing those health inequities. Absolutely. Um, and we also know that it's really clear for us that um, the health inequities that do impact us have very little to do with anything that's genetic or biological. That's we right. know that it is very much steeped in structural and institutional racism because it's not race that's the health risk factor right. here. It's racism that creates the misnomers and the miscommunication in health that have a negative impact upon our community in particular when we're talking about infant mortality rates. And we don't just address it from a perspective of just sim simply engaging the mother and the child. We actually engage the whole family with this perspective. So it's worked for us. It's been successful. It's been impactful. The evidence of that is in our numbers and in our outcomes. And we thank you all for supporting the work that we do and look forward to working with any of you who are focused on addressing these health inequities as well. Thank you. Thank you.